This is a lovely move and one to show your friends your complete mastery of the ball. It's a great favourite of the Brazilian Ronaldinho. Juggle the ball very close to your foot until you are completely balanced and comfortable with it. As the ball drops, delicately tap the ball upwards again by grazing the outside of it and continuing to throw your foot completely around it. You can then catch the ball as it's dropping to continue juggling. This move combines the subtlety of touch demonstrated in the round the world move with brilliant timing and combination footwork. Again, juggle the ball until you are comfortable, balanced and ready to perform the move. As the ball drops, delicately tap the ball upwards whilst throwing your foot over the top of it and remember you're only going halfway around the ball this time, so be careful with your touch and make it light. Instead of letting it drop to the same foot, adjust your feet to enable you to flick the ball up with your other foot. Readjust your feet and continue juggling. Well, what can we say about this one except that a lot of practice and natural balance may help you to perform it one day. Please remember to be careful and use only a 7-up 500ml plastic bottle. Balance the plastic bottle on your forehead and the ball on the open end of the bottle. Keep the cap in your hand and you don't want any litter. No need to explain this one, it's just pure balance and complete mastery of the ball. Just enjoy watching it and have fun practicing it. Approach the ball and stand over it with both feet around 6 inches either side of it. Pinch or snap your feet together underneath the ball in one quick movement. The ball will rise from the ground and you can start juggling. The rollover flick is very similar to a basic flick up except that you throw your left leg over the ball when dragging it back. Drag the ball back towards you with the sole of your right foot. As the ball is arriving at your toes, your left leg is crossing over the ball. In the same continuous movement, place the big toe on your right foot underneath the ball to scoop it up towards you. Readjust your feet to continue juggling.
this slick move incorporates some of the moves from the roll and spin trick. Catch the ball between the instep of your right foot and the area of your left foot just behind your heel bone. Roll the ball up the back of your calf with your right foot in a swift whiplash movement. Now just slam your instep back down on the ball as it's rising to bounce it back off the ground. Half turn to the ball and continue juggling. This is one of the all-time favourite moves for getting the ball in the air and also uses some of the tips from the roll and spin and in-step slam down. This can also be a very effective move for beating a defender. Again, catch the ball between the instep of your left foot and the area of your right foot just behind your heel bone. Roll the ball halfway up the back of your right calf, leaning slightly forward to make room for the ball to come over your head. Move your right and left feet swiftly together as if you were jumping over a small hurdle, making sure to contact and flick the ball with your right heel. The ball should come over your head to land in front of you.